All right, so I already made a video about how to just put air in the tires, but when I first went to do that, I ran into a problem that I'm now seeing a lot of other people are hitting as well, and that's trying to get the valve extender on the valve stem because the valve stem is sort of pointed inward and it just is really difficult. So when I first did this, it took me like 10, 15 minutes of sitting here fiddling with it before I could even ride it the first time. So it was definitely not the best first impression of a $1,600 scooter, but I figured out a way that worked pretty well. And I'll just show that to you right now. So I took the valve cap off. You should be able to do that just you know by finagling it with your finger. And then, yeah, like I said, when I first got this, the valve was kind of pushed in. And so what they give you is this extender in the box. And the idea is you kind of put this on here and then you're able to get you know, a regular pump on it so you can put in air. The problem is, is I couldn't even get it lined up so I could put this on there. So what I finally did is got a paper clip and I undid it like this. And I went in here and I, let's see, kind of put the paper clip around the valve like that, hooked it at the base and kind of pulled it out. And then while I was pulling it out, I was then able to line the extender up. And then, yeah, <laughs> I don't even need to do it this time. It's still a pain. And then get the extender on finally. And then just kind of thread it on there like so. And then once the extender's on, you can, you know, attach a pump to it and pump up the tires. So definitely a pain in the ass. I actually even, once I finally got it, I'm like, okay, I'm leaving the extender on. And then like an idiot started the motor and saw that, okay, the extender is going to hit the fork and that's not going to work. Um, but after I got it out using the paperclip, it didn't happen again where I even needed the paper clip. So I think the valve was just stuck. Somebody else suggested just letting more air out of the tires. I think I tried that. So you could do that, you know, just by pushing in that pin and maybe letting air out of the tires allow you to get the valve out so where you can put the extender on. But it didn't help me in my case, but it could in yours. I think a combo might be, might be best as well. Like let air out and then hook the paper clip in. Kind of a bad design i'm sure it was uh, hopefully it was a hard trade-off for them to make just based on all the other stuff they were focused on and getting the hub wheel working but yeah hopefully that helps somebody